guys, uh, this is Ken Marlin. I'm the Windows Champ from Aero Electronics, and I'm here to give you guys a very quick video on how to disable Windows Update completely. So, uh, for my customer base in the IoT space, um, most of the OEMs are building appliances and they uh, don't want anything to basically pop up on the screen or cause that device to restart or uh, be updated to something new. So they usually go with Windows 10 IoT Enterprise LTSC, Long-Term Service Channel. 2019 is the latest version, 2016 is the older one. And that product does not allow feature updates, so it's locked into a build, no new features, but it still gets security or what they call quality updates. So it still will install Windows updates. Some of my customers don't want that at all. they like, look, it's great. It runs our application. It does what it's supposed to do. I don't want anything else coming along. So you can actually disable those updates. And I'm going to show you. I actually wrote a blog that I'm showing you right here. It's called To Update. That is the question. And I sort of get into a little bit of you know the reasoning uh, why you would still want to do this or not do this. And, and at the bottom of this blog, I do cover the steps that I'm going to show you in this video very quickly. Um, please check out my other blogs. The website is ocs.arrow.com slash msembedded, and I also have lots of dates on lifecycle, end of life, and the support for Microsoft products there, as well as other videos and technical resources, FAQs, but I've written quite a few blogs that you can check those out in there. I'll put the link down in the description of this YouTube video as well, so you can see it there. Now, let's jump right into how to disable the Windows Update. And you do that with the reg registry, um, editing the registry. So what you want to do is type regedit. Say yes to that. Um, when this is opened, it should default here to Windows under Microsoft, under policies. It should go there. And then ultimately what you're going to do is right click, do a new key. Okay. So one thing to note, uh, you the Windows update will may possibly already be there. If it's already there, great. If it's not, you're going to then right click on Windows and do new key and create it. But um, I th for 1809, which is what this system uh, is running, it uh, is already here on mine. So basically gonna go there. Then we're gonna right click that and say new key. And we're gonna call it AU, which stands for automatic updates. Um, and then once you have the automatic update one created, the AU one. Then we're going to right click in this area over here to do a new key, to do a new D word, a 32 bit D word value. And that's what we're going to name. No auto update. And then we're going to double click that. And we're going to give it some values um, in the name. So uh, it's going, well, it's basically going to be, you set the value zero to enable automatic updates and you set it to one to turn off automatic updates. So once that D value is set to one for no auto update here in the automatic update under Windows Update, um, it is set. And at that point, you can close the registry and reboot the device. And now Windows Update is completely disabled. Again, check out my blog on the OCS Arrow website. Um, I have quite a few other blogs in there. But down in that article, which I cover the different kinds of updates, and I also talk about the, the ways to disable the automatic updates. So give that a shot. Also, I have a lot of links to the Windows uh, updates as well as the exact Microsoft website where it tells you how to disable the updates in the registry. So if you need further help, you can always contact us at msembedded at arrow.com for more questions. Thank you guys for watching.